Hunt team just finished our first morning session. Um, it was great before the sun really came and stung us. We were able to get a, a, a killer set. So uh, we just got some smoothie bowls finishing up here. And now we, we bought, I think, like eight of these 25 kilo ice blocks. We've chucked them in this spot. As you see, the boys are about to dip in. Dip in. Go, guys. Let's go. Let me know how you <laughs> It's really cold, right? It's yeah. probably like eight degrees or something, right? This is freezing. So we had like big 25 kilo blocks in there, just sort of uh, relaxing the legs. There's a lot of leg work through the session. Re um, sort of getting some fuel. Actually, I was sick last night from 2 a.m. to 5, just throwing up every 20 or 30 minutes. Sven behind the camera here can vouch for it. He was just like, what's going on? And uh, I didn't know, it's like barley, a little bit of barley belly. I think it's, I had a, had a meal before training the day before and it just didn't mix with me well. So I thought that was gonna be the end of me. And I woke up this morning and feeling like shit, but we got through it. And now we're just sort of getting a lot of our uh, electrolytes and everything like that. Woo! today we would go out to the beach and go for a surf which would be amazing but unfortunately it's king tide so there's just no waves so some people have gone down for a swim which is great uh, however Sven and I we're just sort of working on all the content that we've um, put together already and I'm also updating all the 365 programming muscle hypertrophy so muscle building weight loss strength muscular endurance and uh, everyday athletes so athletic development and uh, it's a massive beast, a huge undertaking because it's myself, a dietitian, and exercise scientist all co collating together and, um, to create these kick-ass programs, all the nutrition and everything behind it. And I've got to have the responsibility of looking after all these guests and doing the training and being, being uh, present in the moment, but also on the other side of uh, the world, I've got this online programming going and it's really cool to see it, it you know, really get, get, gathering some legs and momentum behind it. And I think uh, it's gonna be, gonna be something really cool to have a massive community and something where people are educated and understand their training and, and know what the next step is and how to get their results. So um, that's what we're gonna be working on for the next few hours. We've got lunch time in an hour, but we've already, we've actually ordered some room service with some food and some uh, mm. coconut water. I just need some electrolytes and just continue my hydration build up because of uh, obviously being sick last night. So gonna get stuck into it, get it done, and we'll talk to you soon. I'm coming. Here it is. Oh. Still struggling. Ooh la la. Oh, man, they're calling us. Look at this. This is amazing. Thank you. Yeah, Let me go. Oh, you do. I've got it. Oh, that's heavy. You're strong. <laughs> <Hey>? <laughs> Thank you so much. We're just still hungry. Sorry for the coffee, yeah? No, don't stress. Is that them trying to call us to let us know you're coming? Yes. Yeah, okay. yeah, I'll let them know. Thank you. You're welcome. Epic. How's your day going? It's good. It's good? Bagus? Bagus. Yeah. And they will lunch. Yeah, thank you. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thank you. I'll let them know that we've got it. Hello? Yeah. That's correct. Amazing. Thank you very much. Bye bye. They're just letting me, letting me know that my room service is already in my room. So that's great. <laughs> Mmm, what have we got here? We've got some hot chips, just keeping it safe with the, the belly at the moment. Don't want to get anything too exotic. Um, with some sauce, there's your, there's your coffee too. And we've got some young baby coconuts with some ice in it too, to help rehydrate. So, gonna get stuck into this. Second day, just finished our second session for the second day. So we technically completed the third session. This afternoon was hot, everyone's profusely sweaty, but it was a really short, sharp, intense uh, training session. Everyone loved it, a bit of, bit of body weight, a lot of bar work, a bit of running, um, some team healthy competition. But uh, as you can see right behind me is our first yoga session, which is Ali is running. Um, you know, just getting everyone in the place where you know, you've got to give back to your body. You can't always expect and demand the most from yourself. You're not giving back. So if they want to continue to train twice a day, we've got to get them to do all the trigger balls, we've got to get them rolling out, and we get to do some yoga. So 
we're about to uh, just jump in ourselves. All right, so I, just, I was really keen to do some yoga with Ali and the, and the crew, but um, just got looked at my phone back in the outside world and there's uh, too much demand at, at this time to finish all this programming in time for the, the guys at home and the, and the 365 crew. So we're gonna have to skip the yoga. There's, there's more yoga sessions later in the week, which we'll get into, but for now, we've got to skip our yoga, put all our effort into uh, into our programs now, just before we have dinner and get a massage, which is gonna be amazing. But when I get back, I'm probably gonna spend a couple of hours finishing these programs and then you know, late night, get up early tomorrow morning to train myself before we go and do the obstacle race as a team. So it's like, it's really long hours here. You know, a lot of, a lot of people are like, oh, you're so lucky to go overseas. It's like, must be a holiday. And 100%, hand in my heart, I love what I do. And it's, it's a blessing to be able to do this and meet people and come to these exotic locations. I love it, but it is a lot of, it's a lot of hard work. You know, you've got to have the energy and the commitment and engage with every single person. Always be on your A game. Plus, it doesn't matter if you've got personal issues happening at home or if you've got other businesses that need to be attended to. You know, you need to be able to operate at full capacity all the time. And you know, so, you know, when I get back, sometimes I feel like I need a holiday. So, I'm not crying. I love what I do, but that's where we're at.